on. Oh, I found World Championship Wrestling's Nitro Street Rods, and it's La Parca. La Parca, the original chairman of WCW. That's right. Tommy, how much is that La Parca action figure? Three bucks. Two ninety-five. Three dollars. Tommy, go pick it up. Fuck it, why not? There you go. Let's do some VHS and some toys down here. Got some DVDs here. Haven't seen anything. You know, we do. We, we pretty much just got in the door, and Tommy just found that. So we're off to a good start. What you got there? Guy. Is that Big Show? Yeah, it's Big Show, but it says Guy four dollars. Guy. You, are are you gonna buy the guy? No, I ain't buying the guy. Fun over here, Jay. I found some, a couple of wrestling DVDs. A couple of wrestling DVDs, huh? Yeah. Got the Rock. What was that a dollar? Yeah. Ninety-nine cents. A dollar nine. Yeah. Yeah. That's probably what that is too. A dollar nine. You find any more? Yeah, uh, that's not seen in my life. Dollar nine. A dollar nine. Not bad if you don't have them. Yeah. You go. Huh? I said you got them. I uh, don't have that one. Hmm. Go buy it maybe? Uh, I'm gonna look at the condition. Anything over there, Jay? No. No? Nope. Found some decent stuff so far, though. Guys, if you guys don't know what a Pillars Mall looks like, it looks like this. You just walk around. The rap house. And all they got is Trump shit. Tommy. PlayStation 2 Jam Pack. Yep. See what it has on here. Nine new games. Hot new games. Shadow of the Colossus, I Toy, Deadlock, Ratchet and Clank, Okami. Sounds like some good stuff on here. Laura Croft. Yeah. Beat them. Some nice stuff. And look, a dollar. One Sweet dollar. spot. Oh man, oh, look at that. Okay, well, that's going back on the shelf. Yeah. That's fucking ridiculous. A toilet slam dunk. You play basketball while you're taking a fucking shit. Go ahead and buy it, Tommy. Ten bucks. Ten bucks. Okay, I'm not. And look, you, you put the goddamn basketball court right between the dirty ass toilet. See it? <laughs> ridiculous. Yeah, that's, that's, that's fucking stupid. Hello everybody and welcome to another exciting installment of Wrestling Rampage. The two amigos are back in this bitch with Pops in the background like That's always. That's right. But, but well, Pop, 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 Pops didn't find it. Uh, of course, oh, he did find something there. What? Ass? Oh yeah. <laughs> And so then Pops never finds us a man. I'm an ass man. <laughs> well, do you love to love them? Do, 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 do you love to stick them? Do you love to shove them? It all depends on what ass you're talking you about. Watch them. <laughs> you love to me, watch them. Uh, me, just to make one thing perfectly clear here before we go on here, I just like the women's asses, all right? Tommy, me and you went to Peddler's Mall. Yes, we guys, did. Guys, you seen the footage. We actually got some decent amount of footage yes, for, there. Yes, of course, for we, that. I don't think we can put the sound in. Uh, sound in on some. Yeah, on some, America. Because sometimes they put it in place to fucking music. But, somewhere. Tommy, we found a smorgasbord Yes, of we stuff. did. It even got me a goddamn reduce, reuse, recycle, <laughs> thank you bag. Thank There's you one bag. thing, though, we yeah. didn't find. What was that? And that right there is one one, one thing that, that, I, that I always go there to see is the big, fat-ass girl. Oh, I, I saw one. I'll, I'll let you know. Oh, yeah, she, 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 she had a nice ass, but not, well, Tommy, but not the original and, uh, one. Uh, 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 go ahead and start getting your stuff out. Uh, of go your ahead and get the stuff out, huh? Because we got, we, got we got a lot of stuff to hear. All right. What here. was the cheapest item here? Uh, just lay it down. It yeah, doesn't matter. Just, like, just lay it down. Just lay the goddamn shit down. Damn, what a, what a, what a smorgasbord you got there. Oh, yeah. Smell, yeah. 
here we go, baby. Did you say smeller? Yeah. <laughs> it smells. But anyway. The bag smells. <laughs> Does it smell? Yeah. Well, Tom, Tom is going to be leave, leaving the floor. He's going to Shoot! be, uh, to, he, he, he's going to go down there. He's going to call himself Tony T-Bone. Yeah, fuck you. Uh, we're going to go ahead and show you guys some of the stuff that we picked up. This Tommy showed me, and I was like, Yeah, hey, I'm the one who showed you yeah, that. Why, why not? Because it would be something you'd be into. It, it, it is. Uh, for the PS2, it's MX Rider. Um, uh, is, that, is that the bicycle or the motorcycle? Motorcycle. All oh, right, I like uh, that. Dirt bike. Motorcycle, dirt bike. Um, it is cut right here so I can look at it. That's oh, you always do. want to make sure shit's in there. Uh, the case yeah. is cracked there, but it's not a big issue for me. You can always get another PS2 case. Uh, I already have multiple yeah. ones. Uh, it is a little scratch, though, but, uh, you know, it is what it is. Well, um, here's the thing. We can always call, uh, call our friend to uh, unscratch it. So we, yeah, you see, yeah, see, we can call you, our old buddy. You, old see, buddy. You, you see, we're just like Pawn Star here. We got, we got friends we can call. Uh... On eBay, it sells for about five bucks. I only paid three for it, so why not? Uh, this I bought because I really enjoyed the show. I'm sorry, you know, I'm a big fan of the show. Uh, Grounded for Life. This is the complete second season. And by the way, both of the big titty bitches. Yeah, both the big titty bitches, as Pop calls them. Uh, the daughter and the mom. Well, they're both hot. They're both hot, no doubt. If, if you guys ever watch the show, they're fucking both fucking hot as fuck. And, and it's a good show. It, and this is actually still like sealed brand new by the way yeah it's uh, it hasn't even been opened so uh, it's still brand new and uh uh the it says booth 130 dvd a dollar <laughs> you can pass that up so a so dollar. so for a dollar i bought grounded for life uh the uh, complete second season this sells on ebay for um what the hell do i got it here for uh seven dollars brand new by the way so uh, so for a dollar, that's a no-brainer for that. Uh, I will be opening that and watching, and watching it. it. Yeah, but that you know, that's for you know my personal uh, reference there. Um, let's go ahead and show you guys a Wii game that I picked up. It is Hooked Real Motion Fishing. Here we go. Um, I like fishing games. I'm sorry, I do. There's some uh, you know, for some odd reason, I like them. Even though I've never really been fishing before. Uh, Pops has, but uh, I enjoy playing the, the fishing games, and uh, this, it, it's complete and everything in really good condition, and Hooked Real Fishing sells on eBay for $7 complete, and uh, I got it for $1.99, so two bucks. I doubt, you you guys, I, I doubt you guys would like fishing. Um, and then I ended up getting a couple of PlayStation games. Another fishing game, imagine that. Uh, for the original PlayStation One, it is saltwater sport fishing. That's oh, all. there's the, 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 the I know what that is. That's a that's it's a like damn sword fishing. It is a sword fish. Um, the the case is fucked up though. It's all taped up and everything. Well, um, here's the thing. <laughs> it's all fucking well, fucked up. Here's the thing. Uh -huh. Your best friend left a whole bunch of CD cases. Yeah, he did. No, well, your best friend. Not no, he's your best friend. friend. Is that black? Yeah. Yeah. PlayStation. PlayStation yeah, 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 yeah. You know, it's, it's, it's look like, at it. It's like, it's like clean yeah. as hell. Yeah. So. Uh, yeah, you know, you get some places that are that that, that are actually uh, uh, blue, black. Well, that's for the uh, uh, PlayStation Two. Yeah, yeah PlayStation, PlayStation Two. 2. And, and I and I like the multicolor. God damn, I can't even close the goddamn thing. There we go. There it goes. Uh, saltwater sport fishing for the PlayStation. It sells on eBay for um, five bucks. I paid three dollars for it. Uh, another PlayStation game I ended up picking up was Cool Borders Three. I like snowboarding. And it's and from Nine Eight Nine Sports. Yeah, not no Nine Eight Nine Studios. Oh, Studios. Oh, oh, that was Studio. Well, yes, usually it's, it's sports. Well, I guess uh, that's just a sports game. Yeah, the sports that. sports games. This is like an extreme sports game, but um, it does have a little bit of wear on the disc, but nothing major. And uh, it is the greatest hits, but some people complain about that. I don't care. Yeah, it's the same damn game. So, same damn game. It doesn't matter to me. And Cool Borders Three sells on eBay for about six bucks complete, and I bought it for three dollars. So that was a good uh, score. And um, let's uh, let's show uh, this real fast. Yeah, I bought some nunchucks. 
Uh, I will have to clean these up. These aren't in the best condition. I mean, they, they look like they work, though. So that's uh, that's always a plus. The buttons work. And the, uh, the sticks look like they're in good condition. Um, these are just... Um, excuse me nunchucks and uh and i just needed nunchucks yeah i really did uh because uh, i think i'm missing like one or two and i'll have like a complete nunchucks with like four of them so i just needed them and every time i find nunchucks most of the time they, they don't work so yeah. hopefully these, these work we'll find out um but I paid three dollars a piece for them. That's, that's what they got on the little tag here, uh, and these sell for like eight dollars a piece, so sixteen bucks on eBay. I only paid six dollars for it, so I saved like ten bucks on these. So that's not a bad deal for these. No, it's not. Uh, I will have to clean them though, but it is what it is, right? Uh, let's see. One other thing I got here for the PS2. This. And it says Thomas on it. So I wrote Thomas on it. Hey, Pops, 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 is this you? That ain't me. All right. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not into that much of kind of, kind of games. All right. This is a game I've been trying to find for a while, especially for Dirt Cheap, and I found it finally. This is a game that I've played the demo of for Tony Hawk Pro Skater 3. On Tony Hawk Pro Skater 3 for the PS2, they actually have this game as a, um, God, what is it called? As a, um, demo on there. And I played this game, and I really enjoyed, well, I, I enjoyed the demo. I've never played the actual game, and I always enjoyed the demo. And... I finally found the game for dirt cheap, even though I could have found it on eBay for like six bucks complete. <laughs> but I only paid a dollar ninety, so yeah. I, I paid like two bucks for this game. It is a Sean Palmer's snowboarder. Uh, this is actually made by Activision as well, and that's the reason why it's a demo on the on the uh, Tony Hawk game. The case is broken though, but it is complete with manual. And uh, the disc has some scratching on it, but it doesn't look like it's going to affect anything. And it has T written on it. T! T for Thomas. And uh, I uh, think this is Pop's game. Well, well we can always call old buddy. Old buddy. But, yeah, $6. I only paid $2 for it. Not a bad deal. This is a game I've been trying to find for a little while, especially on Dirt Cheap. So I'm glad I found that game. Uh, Tommy, you want to you want to show off a few things that you got there while I'm uh, recording? Yeah, over sure here? will. I picked up World Championship Wrestling Nitro Street Rods. Now you found that like as soon as we went in there. Yeah, and it's La Parka, the chairman of WCW. The chairman of WCW. So I picked up the La Parka car. It was only oh yeah, there's the price. Yeah, there's the price. Three bucks. Three bucks. But here you could got it came up four bucks, but I'm gonna pay three. Tommy on eBay, that's selling brand new for like fifteen dollars. Yeah, we only paid three bucks for it. Sold on eBay, fifteen yeah, bucks. And for I was the only type cars I collect is wrestling, wrestling cars. Yeah, the wrestling cars. That's it. That's the only type cars I'll collect. How many do you got? Like six or seven now? Yeah. About you know this this might Getting make there, number yeah. eight something like that. So I picked it up. It was only three bucks, and it's La Parka. So. La Parka. La Parka. The, the chairman of WCW. The chairman of WCW. One of the biggest cruiserweights that WCW had. That's right. He was. He was Parker like he, 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 I th I, I, hell, he's I think bigger he was than like, L Dandy. Yeah, bigger than L Dandy. Hey, What's wrong with L Dandy? <laughs> don't 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 downplay L Dandy. That's right, L Dandy. I like uh, L Dandy. Yeah, you did. Um, but yeah, La Parka car. La Parka. Let's go ahead and show you guys uh, one more thing that I picked up here before we start getting into some, some more of the high dollar stuff. Yeah. Uh, this is a game I've been actually wanting to get for a while. And every time I find it at a like game store or whatever, they want like anywhere from like 10 to $15 for it. And I really don't want to pay that much for it. But, as you guys know, I love, I love snowboarding and... and um, uh, skateboarding games and things of that nature uh for the ps3 skate 3 i've heard nothing but great things about this game 
and I've been wanting to get it for a while now. And every time I, every time I have found it, they want it anywhere from like ten to, you know, fifteen dollars for it. And I'm like, eh. But uh, I found it for six bucks. Yeah. So six dollars is a sweet spot for me. So I picked it up. Unfortunately, the case is broken though. The disc is right along around in here, but somebody wrote J and A on it. J and A. Uh, does have a little bit of scratching on it, but I don't think that's going to really. Um, what, what is it? What? What what, what? what to say on it? J and A. Is one of them J M? No, it's not. It is complete, by the way. Unfortunately, the case is broken, but I can always replace the case, so not a big issue. Uh, sells on eBay for about about fourteen dollars. Yeah. So. For uh, for paying you know a little a little under half of what it's worth, that's not a bad deal on that. Well, you like uh, you, you you've always liked skateboarding games I have. anyway. Uh, next game I bought was for the Wii. Uh, you know I I didn't get the greatest deal on this game, but uh, it's a game that I've been wanting to get for the Wii for a while now, and I finally found it. So that's always awesome uh, for the Wii. Super Smash Brothers Brawl. Uh, my son really loves playing Super Smash Brothers, and uh, this is one of the games that for the Wii that I did not have. So, figured uh, I'll just go ahead and buy it because I, I honestly I don't come across this game very often at all. I really don't. Uh, I know it's a hot seller on the uh, on the Wii, but I honestly I just don't really see this game very often around me. Yeah, of course, unless I find it at a game store for like twenty twenty five bucks. Other than that, I really don't find this game that often out in the yeah. wild. So when I found it, I was like, "Fuck it, I'm just gonna buy it." Uh, it is fourteen dollars. I did pay fourteen bucks for it. It sells on eBay for around eighteen to twenty. So um, I did save a little bit of money on it. Not the best deal, but I just don't find it that often. Yeah. So it is there. It is missing the manual, but the disc is in uh, pretty good condition. So overall, I'm happy about it. So there you go. That's all that matters, right? Yeah. And Tommy, you guys seen the thumbnail of the video. The thumbnail is going to be the N64 games that we found. Yeah. Guys, you know, we don't find cartridge-based games that much no. out in the wild. Uh, that is, uh, you know, we can always find them at, at game stores and things of that nature. Yeah. But we don't find cartridge-based games just out in the wild, which yeah. the wild is like thrift stores Flea Goodwills, flea markets, things of that nature. Yard sales. Yard sales. Uh, we did find the, the big N64 yeah. bundle at a yard sale, but yeah. that's that's the only time that we yes. have found uh, like uh, just cartridge-based games out in the wild. Um, unless you find them on like, yeah. Facebook Marketplace. It's not very likely you will. Most of the time you find disc-based yes. games. Uh, that's just the way it is. But um, we did pay up for, for some of these... Yeah. Uh, in 64 games but it was worth it because it's, so, it's stuff that we were wanting to get in our collection yeah. so um let's go ahead and show you guys the n64 games we got uh game i got was for the n64 ea sports's supercross 2000 once again i love dirt bike games <laughs> no shock right I, I love dirt bike games and things of that nature so uh, extreme sports, as they yeah. say. Um, seen it there. Uh, it had a good price on it, five bucks. Sells on eBay for like eight dollars. So I, I saved a little bit though on it. Not not much, but something I've been wanting to get because hey, I love I love Supercross games. So uh, for five bucks, why not? Next game I got is Wave Race sixty four. Um, Kawasaki Jet Ski is what it says there. So that's always nice. And this is actually made by Nintendo, by the way. Uh, this isn't like a. Uh, I love how it says one. Man, who the fuck got it? Got it for a dollar ninety nine. Lucky bastard. I didn't even realize that. Do they all have it? No. No. You know what? You know what that that tag looks like? A Goodwill. It looks like a Goodwill sticker. Whoever got this at Goodwill for two bucks, fuck you. Yeah. yeah. Fuck you. Uh, but anyway, I got it now. Yeah, I, I didn't realize that till now. Yeah, I just saw that. That's a Goodwill sticker around our area. That is. I know that for a fact. Yeah. So, lucky motherfucker. 
I would I would have definitely paid two dollars for this, but uh, I bought it for six dollars, unfortunately. Uh, honestly, this game's worth about fifteen dollars yeah. sold on eBay. So this is a, this was actually a good score on this one. Uh, six dollars for a game that's worth like fifteen dollars on eBay. Not a bad deal for that. And it's a game I don't have, so I said screw it. I'm gonna get it. I'll show this game, and uh, then we can show some of your games. There, All okay? right. Uh, 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 t t Tommy spent more than five dollars for this one. Yeah. Imagine that. GT64 Championship Edition, um, All Japan uh, Grand Touring Car Championship. Jesus, that's a lot of stuff on here. Um, a, a racing game for the N64, nothing that great, but I do enjoy some of the racing games on the N64, so why not get it? Uh, this game is sold on eBay for about 10 bucks. usually. I got it for $7.00. Um, Saved a few dollars on it. Nothing that special, though, but it is what it is. What'd you get there, Jay? Well, I picked up one. It was a really cheap game. It was really cheap. For, I had to go up to the uh, thing and get a... Get yeah, because there's certain ones that have, like, like a glass case, yeah. locked doors, and that's what we have to do. And the chick with the big ass. Oh, I watched that ass. <laughs> oh, I, I bet was, you did. Oh, wow, she was walking to get it. Oh, yeah. I bet, I bet you did. In those fucking sweatpants. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You like that, Jay? Oh, absolutely. What'd you get? I had well, bubble up, she let it fart. I picked up for the N N64 Golden Nugget. Golden Nugget. For $1.99. And uh, you've played Golden Nugget before. Yeah. I remember... Remember when they had they had this in at, at Pillars Mall also? Yeah, there was but, another booth that had it. Fucking it, ten bucks. They wanted ten dollars for the game, and and, and I told Tom, and I, I, go, I, and I go look, there's one for a dollar ninety nine. He goes, well, I'm getting the dollar ninety nine. You damn right I am. <laughs> Would you? Yeah. All right. Well, well I, I already own it. I, I bought it. Like I a, picked like up the goddamn dollar ninety nine one. You damn right I did. Uh, yeah, so I picked up Golden Nugget. Golden Nugget, believe it or not, about a thirteen dollar game sold yeah. on eBay. So yeah. for two bucks, for two dollars, I can pass it up. What else did you get? Well, I picked up again for the N sixty four Napco Museum sixty four. Napco Museum sixty four for ten dollars. Ten dollars. It's got Pac Man, Miss Pac Man, Galaga, Galaxia, Pol. Pole position and dig dug. You like Pac Man? You like Mrs. Pac Man? Yeah, I like Galga. You like Galaxium? Yeah. Do you uh, pole position? Yeah. Dig dug? Not so much. Not so much. Not so, so much on dig dug. So, so you know, five out of six ain't bad. No, nah. but I got it for ten bucks. So that goes to my uh, N64 collection. Sold on eBay thirteen dollars. Yeah. So, so I mean, you saved a little bit of dough. Saved a little bit of dough. And my last game, it's. It's for the N64. Excite Bike N64. Excite Bike 64. Yeah, Excite Bike 64. I paid $12 for it. It sold on eBay for $14, so I mean, he only saved $2 on it. But but here's the thing. It was there. Here's the thing. And sometimes on eBay you can get swindled. Here's the thing. For like it, uh, fakes. Yeah, but here's another thing. And you agree with this. Yeah. In 64 games, when we found these in the goddamn case, we were going to leave them behind. Yeah. Yeah. We now we on. did leave some sports games. Behind. Yeah, yeah, we did leave some. Sports we left games. Madden 2001. That could fucking stay there. <laughs> that could rot there. Yeah, that could rot there. Uh, fucking, there was a NASCAR game. It could stay there. This game, all I, the sports games stayed there. This game, I wish I maybe shouldn't have picked up just because of how much money it was, but uh, yeah, you paid I, quite a bit. Yeah, this one I paid quite a bit for. Uh, Granted, I have the I have the remastered version of it, and I have it on the uh, on the Dreamcast. See, so, yeah, as you can tell, I have it on the Dreamcast. Tony Hawk Pro Skater Two, but then yeah, I bought Tony Hawk Pro Skater Two on the N sixty four. It was there. It was twenty three dollars. That's pretty uh, a lot of money. Yeah, it's it's worth about twenty eight. So I did save like five dollars on it, but still, I wish maybe I should have just left it behind. For you know, granted, I have this and I have the remastered version, but. Is what it is, and, and it goes to your collection. And it does, and it does go for the N sixty four collection. And the last game I got, which was the best deal, as far as what I got everything for, was for the N sixty four Mario Party. 
which I actually have the manual for, yeah. by the way. Uh, so uh, I have this game uh, cartridge and manual. I don't have the box, even though I really don't want the box. So yeah. it's not a big issue for me. So uh, I actually I paid up for this. I paid thirty dollars for this game. It sells on eBay for around forty to forty-five dollars. So I saved anywhere anywhere from ten to fifteen dollars on this game. So this one this one was a pretty good score. So uh, that's everything we picked up at Peddler's Mall. Yes. Whew. A lot of stuff. We spent a lot of money, but yeah. we did actually get some good stuff here. Um, on eBay, we would have spent $240. Yes. Didn't spend that. I'm uh, uh, glad we didn't do that. We spent at Peddler's Mall, we spent $138. Yeah. Uh, quite a bit of money. That's probably uh, the most we ever spent in a fucking Peddler's Mall. Yeah, I mean, I mean, most of the stuff we got were like two, three dollar items, except for like the N64 games and the Wii games. Yeah. Uh, everything else was around two to three dollars. Uh, you know, these were a little bit more pricey, and we can understand why. Don't find these very often. No, well, when so. we did, we picked them all up, except for the sports games. They could stay there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah they could stay there. Uh, total savings of just over a hundred dollars. Yeah. So uh, hundred and two dollars. So not bad. Save not, a little over a hundred dollars. Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. Not too terrible. But uh, hope that you guys enjoyed the video. Hope that you guys enjoyed the vlog as well. Yeah, we did a little bit of vlogging in there. Hope that you guys enjoyed that. If you guys did, make sure you guys give it a thumbs up. Let them know that. Let YouTube know that we're here. That you That's guys right. are watching. Uh, even give it a thumbs down if you didn't like it. Fuck you. I don't yeah, give a fuck yeah I don't give a fuck what people think. <laughs> and guys, make sure that you guys uh, like us on Facebook, Facebook.com/slash Wrestling Rampage Two. Follow us on Twitter at Wrestle Rampage. You can uh, follow me and Tommy on Instagram. Yes, and you can also. Go on Facebook and, and add Big Guy. Yeah, you can add uh, the DT man in you the You the DT man there. I just tell people like I like I fail. That's all. And guys, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button for more great videos coming to you guys. Because we're all that cream that rises to the top. Cream of the crop. And nobody does it better.